hope you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. As you can see, we've already started here. The start of this match marks the beginning of the second half of the campaign. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Yeah, Giorgio Chiellini. He's the very definition of a rock at the back. He's so physically imposing, but also a great reader of the game, and his positioning is usually spot on. The technical side of defending doesn't often get a mention, but just watch this guy's tackles if you want a, a great display of timing and precision. He does it best. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. And it's Quadrado. Good ball, it's found its target. And he's fouled him there. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Ronaldo with a... Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, that's fabulous! That is a gem! An absolute gem! Dispatched expertly, nicely done. Juventus take the early advantage. Done very well to intervene. Juventus are having to deal not just with their opponents, but also with a congested fixture list. It's at times like this when depth of resources becomes so important. And it's a time when the squad is called upon to help keep everything ticking over. That's why we see the bigger squads these days for weeks like this. to get it away Juventus were imperious when the two sides last met and the fans are asking for more of the same the lift Juventus seeing a lot of the ball and have a 1-0 lead to show for it. Just brushed off the ball there. Barona, whose manager came in for a bit of flack after their previous result. Yeah, but he brought the criticism upon himself by making substitutions that didn't really make sense. They added confusion when he really needed cohesion. That's been drilled forward. Ball through needs to be good here. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. A little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Verona seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. Tries to get it forward quickly. Borini plays it forward. Put a stop to that. Well, they could break here. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Well, the crowd clearly like what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending.
Could be thinking about a shot here. Good determined running there, but run back by the defence. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. He's got away. Douglas Costa. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. De Ligt. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Salvatore Bocchetti did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. This more or less is the same position. Muscle memory just needs to be triggered now, doesn't it? This certainly looks appetizing, well within shooting range. Dibala! And how good was that? About as smooth as it gets. And with that goal comes comfort. Oh, that is a bit special. Juventus got themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Strong challenge, but well within the laws. Has a goal! Yes! And they're at it again in double-quick time! A momentary lapse, exploited with glee. Juventus take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, real danger here! And we hit half-time. Well, there's plenty that can be said about the last 45 minutes, but one thing that cannot be said is that it's dull. One-sided, yes, but packed with excitement. This looks well and truly sewn up already, Peter, but please feel free to forget what I've just said if there's a spectacular turnaround. Juventus have established themselves in a position of absolute supremacy. An action-packed 45 minutes, and they have raced into a three-goal lead. Already up and running for the second half. Arthur. Arthur drives it forward. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach, and it may just freshen things up. Barini takes the long option. Tried to play it through. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority. Uh, a cause of mild frustration. Cristiano Ronaldo. Going for goal! Ronaldo not want to pass up the chance to run up the defence. He loves those duels. Well, that was a mini show of self-confidence. It may spark another try or, or another trier. Battles to win it back. Hoists it forward. 
Tazzini desperately wants to get on the end of this. Defending was strong and firm. And it's played forward. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Borini demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. He's gone for it! In it goes! It is no contest! It is a landslide! Simplicity itself. I just think it's clever positioning from clever movement, and when all of that is synchronised with the right pass, that's what happens. Time for a change in personnel. Juventus totally rampant here. De Ligt cuts it out. Now the counter. Plays it into the box. Cut out in the nick of time. Looking to break out here. Been one straight back, and here's Quadrado Dybala. Forward it goes out to the right. Has a hit. No, that's just wide. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, their position is a, a dominant one now, Peter, so introducing one of the youngsters for some added experience is bang on. Dybala. And it's Borini. Get himself into a good position, something for him to cling to. Bernardeschi. De Ligt is being picked on here. Well, there's certain Badu with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. What a save! Terrific reactions! No messing about, just bludgeoned the way. He's in! That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Drives it towards the front. Played back in. Sells... Has a pop! In for the pieces! Couldn't keep it on target. Well, his reaction to that was ultra-sharp, Peter. His anticipation is in fine working order.
Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo spreads it towards the left. Quadrado. It's come loose. And now they can launch a counter. Goes direct to the front line. Dybala. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Salvatore Bocchetti gets it back. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo goes for goal! A terrific save. Dybala hits one and with that the final whistle a great day for attacking football the artists have painted their pretty pictures only one team in it your reflections then Jim Juventus simply imposed their strength from start to finish and this became as predictable as predicted many thanks to Jim and with that it is a very good night